Baby gifts hold a special place in my heart, and I love the process of creating unique items for my children. Not only do I think it will bring them joy one day, but the process helps tune my heart to their arrival and be hopeful for the future. Come with me as I sew baby gifts for my little one over the past nine months. These are simple gifts you can make for your own little one or a friend expecting a baby. The first thing I made for my son was this plush whale toy. I sewed this during my first trimester right around the time I started to feel sick. The first trimester was difficult, but having something to keep my mind and hands occupied was so helpful. I love this sewing kit by Toys by Polina, and it sparked so much joy as I was sewing during a difficult season. One of my favorite gifts I made is this hand-drawn quilt because I got to work with my daughter on it. We began at the beginning of my pregnancy and finished a few weeks before my son's due date. This is such a simple project to do, even if you've never sewn anything. You can simplify it as much as you need and working on this with your little one creates so many memories. The full tutorial is linked below. Next was this super simple Snuggle Me organic lounger cover, and it took less than 30 minutes, and I love the end result. I found this beautiful blue pointel knit at a small fabric shop in Portland, Oregon. I followed my Snuggle Me cover tutorial by simply tracing around the lounger and adding a seam allowance. Using a serger to sew the edges made it a fast project too.
The next project is one that is near and dear to my heart, and like many of these projects, I also made one for my daughter when she was born. A soft, crinkle book is such a fun sewing project, unique to each child. I first began with an idea for a children's book. I then wrote it, edited it, and kept tweaking it until the words felt right. Then I took it to my iPad and used Procreate for the design. This time around, I wanted to brush up on my Procreate knowledge, so I turned to Skillshare to pick up some new techniques. And I'd like to thank Skillshare for partnering with me on today's video. Skillshare is one of the largest online learning communities for creatives, with thousands of classes led by industry pros across film, illustration, design, freelance, productivity, and more. I am taking Intro to Procreate, illustrating on the iPad that I use for many different aspects of my business and personal projects, like the soft books that I really enjoy making. I want to invite you to join me in growing in a creative skill. The first 500 people to use my link will get a one month free trial of Skillshare. Thank you again to Skillshare for partnering with me on today's video. So after I worked out the design for the soft book, I will soon go and print it out and piece the book together. I'm not quite finished with Ames' soft book, but the writing and the design is there. The book is called Stitch Together, and I'm so excited to continue working on this project. For a look on how to make your own soft book, find the tutorial linked below. Another fun sewing project are these mini slippers for babies. I think these are so fun to make. You can make them in so many different fabrics. And I used a little boucle fabric that I actually had on hand because I was making something for my daughter. I found it at Hobby Lobby and, and the slippers turned out so nice. And they were actually really easy to sew with the faux boucle fabric. And one last baby gift that is also one of my favorites is this embroidered sweater. My sister also just had a baby, so I ordered these knit sweaters. And my mom and I worked together to embroider on the chest of the sweater. I love the pairing of the embroidery with the knit, and I think it turned out so great. Now I want to embroider everything. For this, you could easily embroider a blanket or a thrifted sweater. You could do this by hand as well if you don't have access to an embroidery machine. The possibilities are endless and I think it is the sweetest little heirloom gift to pass down. So there are more easy baby gifts ideas where this came from so click this next video to check them out.